Hi, I'm Ed Ray, president of Oregon State University. I wish I could be with you uh, this afternoon to welcome you to this uh, Golden Jubilee celebration. I have to be at some meetings for the Pac-12 and can't be in two places at once, but I did want to take an opportunity to welcome all of you and certainly uh, do a big shout out for the class of uh, 1964, the Golden Jubilee class. Uh, we're obviously happy to have uh, all of the reunion classes that are able to be with, uh, with us here on campus. Uh, my Golden Jubilee is coming up uh, in, in not too long, so I can appreciate the enthusiasm, excitement, and uh, probably relief that uh, many of you are feeling knowing that you've uh, made it to the 50th reunion. I, I hope you'll be back for the 60th and 70th as as well. It's a great time to uh, be on campus. It's a great time to be part of Beaver Nation. I'll share a little bit of uh, that information with you. But most of all, I really want to welcome you back and hope you just have a spectacular time. Uh, special thanks go out to the Alumni Association for all the work they do behind the scenes to make this event uh, and these week, this weekend's activities run so smoothly. But really throughout the year. Alumni and the Alumni Association are uh, great partners uh, for us to uh, work with. Uh, those of you from the class of 64, you could be forgiven if you forget some of the things that uh, were going on when you graduated from college. Uh, the Beatles were appearing on the Ed Sullivan Show. I think that's gotten a lot of play uh, this year, but not everybody remembers the first Ford Mustang came off the production line. And something I remember, and you may remember, was that uh, a, a gallon of gasoline cost 30 cents. In fact, we used to drive around see if we could find the independent station that sold it for less than uh, 30 cents. And uh, for those of you who've, uh, if, you've, if you've made a move recently, bought a house, sold a house, uh, it's worth remembering that a new house cost uh, $13,000 back in 1964. Obviously, things have changed over the last uh, 50 years. Uh, not just the price of gasoline, but a lot of things that uh, have gone on in your lives, uh, in, in this university, in the community around us. And the changes continue to come. They're really quite uh, wonderful. We have two new cultural centers that will be opening uh, later this year. The new Student Experience Center next to the Memorial Union, the renovation in the Memorial Union, those are going forward. Austin Hall, the new building for the College of Business, uh, is uh, quickly uh, getting ready to uh, come online. Uh, we also have a residence hall that uh, we expect to be opening. All of those will be available uh, either early fall or during the next uh, academic year. The campaign for OSU is obviously uh, tremendously successful. You remember we started out with a goal of 625 million, we raised it to 850, we raised it to a billion. Uh, by the end of this year, we're now in excess of 1 billion, 30 million dollars, uh, and that money goes to wonderful causes. We've raised uh, over 177 million dollars in scholarship and uh, fellowship funds. In fact, uh, we raise more money for scholarships and fellowships and distribute more than any other university in the state, and we intend to uh, keep doing that. Uh, we're committed to uh, making it possible for students to come here and get a, a world-class education. And in that regard, uh, I really want to thank uh, all of you for your gift that will make it possible for transfer students who are looking to uh, be successful here uh, to come to the university. This is the gift of the class of 1964. Uh, that's obviously consistent with all that we're trying to do to provide uh, access to, to the university for students and transfer students are becoming an increasingly uh, important part of the student uh, population that we have here. So again, uh, thank you all for coming. I hope you have a wonderful experience. Catch up with old friends. Be sure to tour the campus and see all the changes uh, that are occurring. Thank you for your support throughout the year, over the years, and uh, I wish you a very happy, uh, successful uh, reunion and a wonderful, wonderful uh, new year. Good luck to all of you.